thank you for joining us. If this is your first time visiting the channel, my name is Mike Milanovic and I'm one of the outside trailer salesmen here at Triscate Trailer Sales. And today we're gonna to review some of the trailers that we have available for sale. And today we're gonna to be reviewing a 2024 Heil Midwest Cementer. This particular trailer is a dry bulk pneumatic tank, 1,040 cubic foot, and this particular unit is set up for hauling cement or other similar products. This is a lightweight trailer coming in at 8,725 pounds, plus or minus 3% as the industry standard. They achieve this lightweight through aluminum end frames. Coming back here on your T's and piping, this is all aluminum T's, aluminum pipes, hot air line on the driver's side here for easy control, five inch product valves, four inch piping going back to the rear, this trailer is also rated for an operating pressure of 25 PSI. That is something that Heil is very proud of with this particular product. Some of our competitors offer a 15 PSI, 18 PSI for your operating pressure. This trailer is meant to be able to be operated at higher pressures if needed. Another option that we do here is with your gauges. Some of our competitors mount them flush to the end frame or onto the barrel main frame itself. We put ours right into this nice enclosure. Two things for this, it keeps them out of the weather, keeps them clean, longer lasting, but also when your driver is operating the trailer at the front, he's able to see his tank pressure and line pressure right here without having to go to the rear of the trailer and avoid leaving control of the valves. Coming further back, this trailer is on air ride suspension, Hendrickson. 23,000 pound air ride with the race center axles. And what that does is that allows for a nice smooth plumbing for your product discharge line straight to the rear of the trailer. The aluminum, aluminum wheels come standard on this through Tri-State. Coming to the rear of the trailer, we have your rear ladder for accessing the three manholes. Air lids are an option for this trailer that we can retrofit at any of our Tri-State locations. So if you see this and you want maybe a middle air lid or two air lids, we can always accommodate you. Drum brakes are the standard. Disc brakes are available uh, for production orders. You get one 21 foot hose tube. And then coming further towards the front of the trailer, uh, galvanized suspension hangers are also the standard on these. Another option is these are gonna be on duels. Uh, for customers that want additional weight savings, super singles are an option. Coming further up, you're, you're able to see on the on the road, excuse me, the curb side of the trailer here. Everything is nice and clean, uh, being that all your hot air lines and controls are on the opposite side of the trailer. Two-speed landing gear is also standard. On our final thought that makes a Heil different from some of our other competitors is the struts. These struts are pinned in, and what it allows for is when you're going to a concrete plant, or we have some customers that use similar trailers in the 1040 line for hauling frac sand or roofing granules, or you're off, you're off road and, and you need the trailer to be able to flex. These struts allow the trailer to flex and what it does is it's not taking all of that torsion and twist and directing it into the barrel and causing cracking issues. Uh, some of our competitors offer a very stiff design with the way their struts are bolted on and it basically just allows the trailer to disperse all of the twist and flex into the barrel which causes cracking issues, longevity issues. Um, very nice feature that Heil has done for decades. Thank you for joining us today. My name is Mike Milanovic and if you're interested in any of the trailers we discussed today, please feel free to contact your nearest Tri-State location.